Good morning and welcome back to my daily vlog. This is Sarah, your socially awkward seller, and I am a full-time reseller on eBay, Amazon, Poshmark, Mercari, and Facebook Marketplace. Mostly on eBay. Mostly. I'm just saying mostly on eBay. Um, and I thought I'd go over a few sales that I got overnight. Um, I, something else sold, I think, but they haven't paid for it, so I'm not going to show that. Um, this sold on my smaller store, and this is a Sweet Pickles uh, book bag. I found seven of these. They're, they were new, um, and uh, I found seven of them. I paid 90 cents each for them. This is the second one I've sold. I knew they were going to be a slow-moving item, but um, I, I just thought they'd be so desirable that it would be worth picking them up. Um, so this is what they look like, and Sweet Pickles was a book series that I remember from my childhood. Yeah, I believe I believe I used to read these. If I didn't read them myself, I read them to my kids. I just can't, you know, memory. This sold for twenty-eight dollars and seventy-four cents, and um, they paid shipping, of course. Enough rambling and ruminating. Um, this is cross stitch pattern. It's a vintage one from Bucilla, and um, it's called Our Blessing, and this sold for $23.74. This is a Ralph Lauren active wear, uh, kind of a quarter zip, uh, long sleeve shirt. Um, this sold for a best offer of $11. And finally, um, I sold that 16 ounce Tivana Perfect Tea um, Tea Maker. Can I say tea one more time? Um, you use loose leaf tea in the tea maker by Tivana. Um, anyway, this sold for $12.34, and the buyer sent me a message saying, I need this by X and X date. Like, I can control how long the mail will take or how far away from me you are. Um, I think that this is probably going to get to them on time because they live one state away. And I think the date was like the 22nd or something like that. So, they should get this and it will go out this morning. And that's it. That's all it sold so far. Um, but I am going to take a couple of pictures either this morning or this afternoon and get some listings live. And um, I'm going to go out and hit a couple of Goodwills, I think, try and find some inventory because, as I, say, I, have, as I have said, I'm pretty much out of inventory and um, I need to list some stuff, some new stuff, stuff, stuff I don't have to list. The stuff that I have to list, I've already drafted. I just need to take pictures of it. Stay with me. Stay with me. Okay. All right. So that's kind of what my day is looking like. Um, let me know in the comments below what your day is looking like. What did you do today besides maybe, um, you know, your regular job? Um, let me know what, what, you know, what are you cooking for dinner? I love those comments. I just love those comments. So anyway, enough about me. I will come back and talk to you later. Hey there and welcome back. It is the end of the day and I did pick up some things at the thrift stores today. Um, I hit two stores because I didn't have a lot of time because uh, uh, you know other things other things um, but I did pick up some stuff I didn't spend a ton of money but it's enough to keep me busy in the next day probably or so I don't know um, so let's look at what I picked up that's not anything all right first thing I picked up is this Paw Patrol lamp. Look how cute this is. And I paid uh, $4.99 for this and I've got it lo listed locally for $15. I know that's not a huge flip, um, but it's money. And for those local flips, I don't have to do anything. Take a few pictures, answer a couple of questions, and uh, they will come right to my door and pick it up. Um, I found another Turvis. It's a bigger one than the ones that I bought before. This one is Dr. Seuss. Sus. Dr. Sus. Oh, the places you'll go. Uh, and it's got the images 
the art from that book, which is really cute. I paid $1.99 for it. Um, I don't know if this size comes with a straw. I don't think it does. Um, it does have a tiny bit of damage right there, but I will still try to get about $15 for that. I'm not sure if this is worth much, but it is a VCR uh, video head cleaner. Um, it, it looks new, like the packaging doesn't look like it's been opened, but I paid 99 cents for that. I'll see if I can get about 10 bucks for it. Uh, let's see. I got myself some wax melts, because that's a fun thing to do. Um, I paid $7.99 for this lot of flatware. And it is a mixed lot, which is not that big a deal. That down's making noise. Get ready to make some more noise. Uh, most of the pieces that are in this lot, two different floral patterns. Cool. Oh, it's hell to get old. Let me just tell you. If you don't. I used to make fun of people, not outwardly, but I'd be like, wow, what are they doing with that magnifying glass with the light? Well, now I know. Because uh, I see nothing. Okay, this is um, Oneida, uh, which I thought it was Oneida, and it is a rose pattern. This is SSS, um, the offshoot, I guess, or the, the branch. I don't know, the model, if you will, by Oneida. And this one is also Oneida. And I'm wondering if this is Lasting Rose, which usually does pretty well. Um, there's quite a few pieces of that in here. And then there's a, let's see what this other set is. I know this is riveting entertainment, isn't it? Isn't it? This is a newer set is a pretty good pattern and this is also Oneida so I should do pretty well with this and then whatever I'm unable to sell lotted up will go into my random my random uh, jewelry makers lot and when I get that box full I will sell that okay now I've got a satisfied Um, it will go in that random lot that will sell, I think I sold the last one for about $35. So I'm going to stop touching this. Ugh. Starting to get a little hoarderific in here. I paid $0.90 cents for this. And it is actually the um, lid and plunger for a Starbucks barista um, French press. And I don't know that this will be worth much, but I thought for 90 cents as parts it might be. So I thought I would give that a shot. Um, picked up picked up a few rolls of uh, wallpaper border, which I have not picked up for quite some time, but I think these patterns um, will do okay. So the first one I picked up, this was for $1.91, and this is crayon and measuring tape um, border, and there are seven rolls of this, and I thought this would be so cute for like a, day, a daycare or something like that. So I'll get that listed, and now I always have to figure out, do I sell it in a lot, or do I sell it individually, um, and they can just buy it however much they want. I don't know. Uh, I paid 90 cents for this roll, and I have sold this one before. Um, actually, I think it goes like this. Um, this is a laundry, like a clothesline with clothes hanging on it, so um, I know that that one will probably bring about 12 bucks, I think, 10, 12 bucks. This one, I'm not even sure. There's some type of animal right here. Could be a bunny, could be a fox, could be a cat, could be a deer, I don't know. Um, when I do wallpaper border, I will take a picture of the package closed like this, sealed, 
and I will then take a picture of it rolled out so I can show the pattern. That's what my friend Chris has recommended I do, and that seems to work so far. Uh, unless I can find a stock photo of this, but you know how eBay is with stock photos. Let's see. And then finally, there's this cafe beach scene. Beach because there's palm trees. Cafe because there's tables and chairs. Um, and this is York. It's a pretty decent quality um, wallpaper border. So I'll look for 10 to $12 on that one. And... Uh, it, when somebody buys like a a single roll like that, I'm always like, well, maybe they did a renovation in that room and they need this roll to replace it. Like I had come up with all these ideas of why they would want one roll. Maybe they're wallpapering their closet. I don't know. Um, I found this. This is way, way vintage. This is from Spring Made. And look at those colors and look at that print. This is two pillow shams, pillow cases. I paid 99 cents for those. And then this is a spring made twin fitted sheet. And there's the whole magic together right there. Look at that. Um, I'm gonna sell these two in a lot. Although with a twin bed, you don't typically need two pillow, pillow cases. Not my problem. Uh, I paid $2.99 for this, and um, I don't know if I'll be able to find comps. Maybe. I don't know. But um, I will sell those probably together. Just depends on what the comps tell me. Uh, that's all my stuff. So, just a couple more things. Um, one is this. This is a Cuisinart Grind and Brew coffee maker. Um, yellow was the color today. Today the yellow, the color was yellow. And um, so I got half off on this, so I paid $3 for it. And um, my thinking is probably to part this out. Because uh, there's all kinds of yummy parts in here. Like this whole thing pops out. Uh, I don't know why you'd ever need that whole assembly, but uh, I don't ask questions. I just sell stuff and clearly break it. Uh, and then I thought, worst, ca you know, you know how I am about worst case. I sell the carafe for 15 bucks, you know, so I was sure to get my money back for this. It does work. I will research it and see if the coffee pot sells by itself um, for a decent amount. If so, I'll probably sell it that way. But um, I don't know. It could go either way. And then finally, I picked this up. It is a Sony boombox. Do they call them that anymore? They don't make them anymore. How could they possibly call them that? Um, radio, stereo, cassette, CD. Uh, I don't know. Does this even have cassette? No, it does not. Um, does it? That feels suspicious. Huh. Yep, does. It does have tape on it. Well, isn't that just fancy? Um... I bought this. I paid $3.99 for it. It doesn't have a cord, and so I couldn't test it. And uh, I have a cord for this, so I thought I'll take the chance. But my grandson's uh, kindergarten class was looking for one. That's why I picked this up. If they don't need it, like if they've already gotten one, then I will re resell this. Um, I haven't looked it up. I don't know what it'll go for. But uh, sometimes these will just go for like 30 bucks, but I, bought, I paid four for it. So I'm not mad at any of that. So those are the things that I bought. I really wanted to do more shopping than that today. Uh, did I buy a couple things yesterday? Oh, I think I already showed you those. Um, the boots and the blender. The cats in the cradle and the boots in the blender. Um, but I just didn't get there. It, I just didn't. Um, tomorrow I'm going to get a haircut because I desperately need one, and maybe I will stop at a couple of places tomorrow, um, just seeing how the day goes. Since I didn't get anything listed today, hmm, that needs to happen tomorrow as well. I'm big on procrastination. You know, if you can put off till tomorrow what you could have done today, I'm good with it. It's not a good way to be. It's just who I am. So anyway, uh, enough rambling. I will talk to you guys soon tomorrow if you're not busy. 
stop by. Um, but uh, that's all I've got for you today. Just remember, just remember that the dream works when you do. So keep dreaming and keep working, and I'll see you guys the next time. Bye.